the features of the buddhist education are namely like life is full of suffering causing of suffering and you know the cessation of suffering and path of liberation when the one attains all these features i mean understands this then only he can actually recognize the whole life and the life is full of suffering why did he say this this is a suffering in the world and the human beings has to realize this and also he has to go through the cause of suffering what is the reason for suffering is like the birth the will the clinging the thirst the self the sense experience the sense object contact sense organs cognition embryonic organism like you know different types of initial consciousness inspiration impressions and and in, again the last one is ignorance of truth this is all because of the cause of suffering and then we have to lead to the next stage that is called cessation of suffering now we have to stop the cause of suffering so that the suffering also gets ceased which means the reason why the suffering is caused we have to stop that so that even we can stop the suffering so because you got hurt you are crying not because you are crying you got hurt so stop that hurt first clean that wound then you stop suffering that the pain is going to stop and then the pain and sorry the path of liberation is a final step the path to be followed to reach the state which is free from misery and pain through eight fold path what is that eight fold path now it is right views right resolve right speech right conduct right effort right mindfulness right livelihood and right con concentration so all these are the beautiful precious points said by buddhism and its features